there's. I know. Wait, what? <laughs> Bro, Lucas, what is even that character? Uh, the boy. No, it's there's two. It's not a boy, it's like one of those adults who are. Have those diseases where Does he have like Benjamin Button disease? <laughs> yeah, exactly. He's actually like 70. Oh, did you see that like that fake video of the midget <laughs> pretending to be like a, a primary school kid on a bus? No, uh, it sounds like a jackass skit though. It looked like it, but it was some other people, but it was very funny. Because <laughs> like this dude is like <laughs> be, like throwing this child off the bus, like a small child. It's like, get down! Oh get yeah, I have seen that. What the hell is wrong with you? And then he's like, he's a man! And then they're like, oh! Yeah, actually, uh, I have seen what you're talking about. Yeah, that's a good crap. Who's the celebrity that has that? Like Andy Milonakis or something? Oh, yeah, he just like looks really young. Yeah. Don't know why. Lucas is just bad in this, right? <laughs> I think, I think with the. Uh... With some labbing, I think he's better than Ness. No. But not by much. I think it's pretty close. I think people are under the assumption that more options mean better character. It means you've got more variability, but it doesn't mean that your options are better options. Yeah, I just think that the down B is a really useful tool. Yeah, people think that like Fox's shine is super useful too, and it like, has its moments, but... It's pretty like good. Nullify, nullify how crappy he is as a character. I'm looking it up, Josh. He's been he's been DJing for a while. Are you talking about DJ C? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Andy Milnock is is a, a big DJ Seer now. Oh. Oh, yeah. how good was that guy yesterday who joined? Who like? talking about how he discovered Yoshi Double Jump. Oh yeah. Well that video is from like, <laughs> that video is from like 2012 or something, but still. Oh, I confused Andy's. People were pretty mean to him, but it was pretty funny. There have been a lot of just weird posts in that group lately. Yeah. A lot of, Which... a lot of spam, like people posting random streams and stuff, but then like weird stuff like that. Yeah. Really I think um, COVID. COVID's got people back at the games they play. Now that we're done with uh, Kiro desk posts, someone else <laughs> needs to fill the void. That was the best time. <laughs> it's great because then he just br he brought it to Discord also. <laughs> yeah. Well, COVID. Has got Carol on Discord. That's like the uh, main development for this Smash world. I think he was there. He's like, how do I set up Windows 10? <laughs> Dude, I'm so glad we got to see a PK Fire combo. <laughs> Finally. Did you see that? Oh, like, yeah. That Japanese Lucas combo where he comboed into a B? Yeah. Mm. That was actually pretty cool. Mm. It's weird, it seems like, until Lucas, there wasn't heaps of Japanese people using Remix. And I actually, it was probably just because Japanese characters came out in this update. Yeah, that's that's probably a big part of it, is that, like, you can you can play the Japanese version of the game now in Remix. Although, is Shield... Because I'm pretty sure Shield Breaks last less... Like, a shorter amount of time in J version. I'm not sure. There's a couple of things that I feel like they haven't covered yet, and people are going to notice and be a bit weirded out by. I know a lot of the a lot of the Japanese guys are playing it, and there's been a decent amount of feedback. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> Josh says there are people working on Ganon LD. Is that Ganon and Dark Samus combos before we Oh, okay, I didn't see much, but maybe. Yeah, like we we just saw them playing over there. Yeah. I'm with Jack, why are Japan isn't real? <laughs> it's also less accessible in Japan if you ever drive. Uh, I don't think that really matters, Josh. Like, people play online most of the time anyway. Well, definitely now. Yeah. 
Even before. Like, yeah. You know how many people play online who don't play? Like, you think America has like a degenerate online scene? Like, Japan has so many people, no one knows who they are. Like, so, like, whole team is with like the lifestyle. <laughs> Japan's always been big online. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, 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 the jab grab. It's not a true jab grab. Yeah, I know, I know. That's why it's funny, though. I saw someone in the last tournament was rolling out of it. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. Um, Bach, that desk got, yeah, I know, I know who you mean. Okay. Wait. Oh, so you're just playing the correct right now, is that right? Yeah. Oh, okay, that makes, makes a lot of sense. <laughs> it's like so empty in chat, and I was like, how is he doing? He's sandbagging. Yeah, that's right. Oh. Wait, and he's pretty good now, hey. Yeah, he's pretty good. He, uh, that's cool. If you go back and watch. I guess I think it was in boss the boss battle online tournament. He went to yeah. game five with LD. Wow, a Samus. No, he beat him. He took a set, didn't he? No, nah, he went to game five. He didn't win though. What a Krovy. Krovy took the set. Yeah, and empty went to game five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty sick. Yeah. Was that a Samus? That was a Samus. That was crazy, hey. I, I mean, I, that, that matchup should be like unwinnable. It should be. Yeah. Oh yeah, PK yeah. fire. But you know, stranded lost to um oh, everybody. Uh, yeah. Himself. What's it? Yeah. What's the Japanese Samus? Not Josuke. The Japanese. Oh, Napon. Napon. Yeah. I didn't realize. I didn't realize he Maypon. lost that. He lost that as Fox. He got destroyed. Oh wow. Well, it's stranded. He probably just played like an idiot. Yeah, he did. It was well, like you know, if someone has a really good punish game and you play like Stranded does, yeah, you can lose every game. <laughs> Stranded said he lost a Maypon to make Witty pay a bounty. <laughs> as long as Witty paid. Maypon also trained by Josuke. Bro, Josuke is not that good. <laughs> I played him in Japan. It wasn't that good. Ooh. Josuke confirmed. I didn't take a game, but... I, I didn't take a game, but he still, you know, wasn't impressive. Birdie's Samus, probably about the same level. Birdie Samus? I don't think I've ever seen it. Yeah, it's not actually that good. Bro, boom. Birdie's probably, like, hasn't played since you were in Australia. Like, at a tournament. It's been, like, almost that long. Oh, he just doesn't play anymore. Yeah, he's becoming a vet, and so he just does a lot of uni work, like studying all the time. Oh yeah. Now Dino, Dino's the man in the beat nowadays. What's going on with Pete? Bro, Pete. Yeah, I don't know. He like, he like goes to tournaments if they happen in Melbourne, generally, like the big ones, but. He doesn't really play outside of that. He's still okay, but he, like it's he lost to like a like a really bad player at the last one. A guy called Paul, who's like not very good, um, but he's just like a, a campy Kirby. So I don't know. Those campy Kirby's will get you. <laughs> Josh said, "Did Dino also beat you in 100 straight Pika Falcon games?" No, that wasn't Dino. That's Quincy. Oh yeah. Yeah, Quincy's Pikachu. Oh, look, okay, let me set the record straight on this one. I was very tired, and we were playing. We were playing for like probably ten or fifteen minutes, so probably like three or four games, and I hadn't won one. And then James comes up and he's like, "Jesse, have you not won one yet?" And I was like, "No, nah, I haven't won." And he's like, "It's all right, I'll coach you." And so James is like standing there, like yelling into my ear, whispering sweet nothings. And then everyone else, and like, I can't stop laughing. It's very, like, I, I, I can't do it. I find it really funny. You couldn't and stop laughing the... for a hundred games? <laughs> More or less, man. That's must have been true. hilarious. It was pretty funny, because then like, everyone... <laughs> James is a like, funny guy. 
10 or 15, James is freaking funny. There's like 10 or 15 people standing behind me just like, come on Jesse, no, don't lose, no. <laughs> and I just couldn't do it. There were multiple games where I was up and I just was anti-clutch. I don't know, man. You just couldn't and then, not lose. I couldn't. And to be honest, James is very good and his punish game is really nuts. And so I like make a mistake and I'm dead and it's just, I don't know. It happened. It happened. I played <laughs> for like an hour and a half without taking a single game. It was brutal. I'd do it again though, it was funny. I always lose 100 games to Puga. Smash yeah, well. SmashCon 2021. It's gonna be the rematch. <laughs> right before Grand Finals, we take a break and do that. <laughs> Maybe that's Jaden. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> And here now, two mid-level Australians will play each other for an hour and a half. Classic 64 holding up the tournament. <laughs> Val said he almost got 99 stock. <laughs> <laughs> How is that possible? In Falcon Dittos? I don't believe it. Against who? How and do you not that, get one grab? After that, um, I, I, I don't know if I can believe the bard story anymore now. Dude, yeah. imagine imagine being down 99 to 1 and knowing you just have to take that one stock. Oh, man. <laughs> so much pressure. Playing bad is an understatement. No okay. one has ever felt that much pressure before. Oh, no, I did when I played Bray on 14 stocks the other day. And I, I was like, I can't lose a game because otherwise I'll never hear the end of it. And I lost a game. <laughs> <laughs> Easy comeback. Like, Reverse 99 stock. Let's go, dude. I played, when I went to Japan, I like was playing Josuke, and he was like, "Do you want to play like a 12 character battle or something?" I was like, "How about my 12 Falcons versus your 12 characters?" And he's like, "Okay." And he starts with Falcon, and just like <laughs> takes like six of my Falcons with his one Falcon. <laughs> <laughs> when you said six, I was like, only six stocks? And I was like, okay, six characters. Falcons, bro, so like 30, oh no, whatever, 24 stocks. That sucks. Alright, Empty. Bro, that was smart. Um, that that Dark, skin of Samus, it just looks like Dark Samus has like a bloody stump for an arm. Yeah, it does. Mm. <laughs> yeah, Bark, what you said before, Dino is the guy to beat, but Jaden is the guy who can take 100 games off in a row. <laughs> Three, two, one. Go! Jaden's more consistent, <laughs> Dino has a higher ceiling. Australian meta evolves. <laughs> Wait, Griffith, did you beat Flanders or did you lose to him? Oh, I beat him. Yeah. It was really close, though. Yeah, 2 1, hey. That was fucking forever ago. Yeah, Snosa 2? Damn, three. 3. 3. That was a fun tournament, though. I loved Flanders. He was great. He's a really nice guy. Oh, yeah. He was a homie. Yeah, he's cool. I think we teamed in Mario Party teams. And I won the Mario Party game, but we lost by coins. <laughs> oh, that sucks. I still popped off, though. <laughs> Mario Party sucks. Screw that. I like playing teams in Mario Party. Everyone always wants to play at like 4 a.m. and I'm too tired to understand what's going on. That's the best. No. I've lost 42 straight games of ping pong and I'm pretty good. <laughs> what? 42 straight. Oh, Bowser's just going off and treat chat. I love it. That's like me saying that I'm pretty good at Smash after losing 150 games straight. <laughs> oh no, 100 games straight. An hour and a half. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. There's a video of It's that crazy you that you played a hundred games in an hour and a half because a top eight takes three hours. Yeah, well that's what I mean. Like I was not playing carefully. I was very tired, recklessly throwing myself at him. And like, Jaden kills quick. 
Just Back and forth. Good, good, great games. Everyone should go watch them. Very pleasing games. Still available. <laughs> on yeah, while they're hot, soon they're gonna be on a Pornhub Premium and you can't get them for free anymore. <laughs> yeah, that's right. No, in Defa's Patreon. That's where they'll be. <laughs> <laughs> Oh PK yeah, fire. PK, PK fire. fire. Right, I didn't really understand that that was that good for Lucas, but it really is. PK well, who else came to Let's Go Baltimore? Is Indefa and who? Is it Yoshi? James. 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 Oh. DK. Yeah, DK. Uh -huh. They were they were awesome. Yeah, and they've roomed with Marigus and Dexter and didn't play a single game with either of them. Like, what the hell is wrong? With <laughs> That's kind of <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> How does that happen? <laughs> Uh, I think Marie and Dexter were playing each other because they were like, we need to get better at, like, let's play actual good people. They were in a really competitive mindset at that point in their career. And I think, um... They had a really good match against each other in that tournament. Yeah, and I think James and, and Sim were just like, oh, we can play lots of people. It's alright, we don't have to... I, look, I don't know, man. If it was me, I would just be like, alright, boys, let's do it right now. I'm 